Across the Caribbean and indeed across the world, we have La Nina in effect. This tends to bring a lot more moisture from the mainland into the southern Caribbean, from Venezuela and to Guyana. The La Nina also brings cooler conditions over northern South America, at least as we go through December and into February. And this will likely occur over Tien Trinidad, Tobago, Venezuela and the Guyana as well. Well, right now it has been a quite sunny in Trinidad, but there's a bit more moisture set to come through as we go into the latter half of this week. So we could be seeing a few showers there, but some more rainy spells expected for Georgetown with only a high of 31 degrees Celsius. St. George's should see a lot of sunshine as we go through Thursday, 32 degrees Celsius, the high there, joining Kingstown in St. Vincent, about uh, Bridgetown in Barbados. will be mostly cloudy at times, but the cloudiness will thicken as you go further to the north, up towards Antigua and St. Kitts, barely managing 31 there in a Bastyr. Now across the Central Caribbean, we've been talking about a trough, but that trough is now lifted, pushing towards the west, bringing a lot more of the showers across uh, Jamaica and parts of central Cuba. So therefore, Kingston will still see some showers with only a high of 31 degrees Celsius. Havana will also join under the cloudiness, barely managing 29 degrees Celsius there. And there will be a few brief showers coming through for Port-au-Prince and the 31 expected for Santo Domingo. So that's your Caribbean travel weather. And uh, that's it from me.